in the category of Outstanding Achievement in Character Animation in a Television or Media Production. The nominees are... Whenever a cleft is completely out of options, their final resort is to play dead. What's wrong with your head, lady? The idea behind the Japanese art of Kintsugi is that cracks in an object are part of its history. What does that have to do with anything? We have to look at trauma. <laughs> you know I love my country. My real crime, my only crime, is a profound difference of scientific opinion. Oh, oh, wow. You'll never get these shoes! <laughs> What were you saying? And the Annie goes to David La Liberté for Hilda. Hi, thank you so much for the award. Uh, it's an honor to receive. I'll start out by thanking the organizers of the event. I imagine it wasn't so easy to organize given the state of everything. I'd like to thank Mercury Filmworks for the wonderful 10 years of employment. Thank you so much to my wonderful partner, Jesse. She's been with me since the beginning. Uh, shout out to my bros, Dr. Love and the Plant. Uh, thank you so much, mom, dad, Aaron, for letting me pursue animation as a career. It wasn't as promising when I was starting out. Uh, thank you to Chantal Ling, Kathleen McKinnon, Andy Coyle, Megan Ferguson, Leanne Savoy, Mercury, the Mercury Production Direction and Management on Hilda. Thank you to the builds, setup, effects, compositing, and editing departments for bringing the scenes all the way. Thank you so much. In the category of Outstanding Achievement in Editing for a Television or Media Production, the nominees are... Hands up, don't shoot, was for b-boys blocking jump shots. Now brown boys blocking cop shots. Instead of hoop dreams, it's now cell blocks. Instead of hoop dreams, it's now gray plots. Hilda! out of the antique store. We said goodbye to lamp life and initiated the escape plan. <laughs> and the Annie goes to John McKinnon for Hilda. There's so many people I want to thank. Luke Pearson, Netflix, everyone at Silvergate Media, Chantel Ling and Andy Coyle who knew Hilda was right for our studio and fought to make it happen. Andy, thank you for trusting me to do my thing and leading with clarity and passion. And everyone at Mercury Filmworks, Megan, Vu, Mike, our storyboard team, our production team, anyone who's touched the show at all. To Brian, Brandy and Jerry Popovich, Kyle Marshall and of course my parents who helped me get my footings in Ottawa, learn my craft and hopefully be a decent person along the way. And to my wife Kathleen, none of this happens without you being there every time I've come home late after an edit. Humoring me when I'm fired out of a cannon and supporting me when I couldn't see the light. Your belief in me keeps me going and I love you. And to our dog Cooper, thank you boy for keeping mum company whenever I'm not around. Lastly, a year ago the city of Ottawa lost our dear friend and beloved editor Kevin Kovar. I miss you Kev. This is for you. In the category of Outstanding Achievement for a Television or Media Production for Children, the nominees are... You've always been there for me, and you've never asked for anything in return. If this is what you want, then you should go. My drill is out of beta! Johnny, nice! Now put it in action! I did! It's just for hero poses. The Republic couldn't have asked for better soldiers, nor I a better friend. Time 
and the Annie goes to Hilda, the deer fox. Thank you. If you are seeing this, then that means I guess we have just won for best children's series this year, and that's pretty uh, that's pretty wild. Um, thanks to Luke Pearson, the creator of Hilda, uh, Stephanie Simpson, who is the head writer on our show, Kurt Mueller, Brian Korn, everybody at Silvergate Media, Mercury Filmworks, Clint Elan, Chantal Ling, my assistant director, Megan Ferguson, all of the artists who work really hard to make this show what it is. Bella Ramsey and our entire voice cast, Oliver and Amira and Daisy, everybody. Uh, Dave Peacock, our voice director, the Swamp Man himself. I'd like to thank Ryan Carlson, who did the beautiful music in this episode, and Don at Agoraphone that does our music licensing. Nobrow, the home of the Hilda Comics, where the show comes from. And finally, Dominique Bizet and Will Cartwright at Netflix. To anybody who watches this show and enjoys it, uh, thank you so much. I really appreciate it.